LSI stands for Latent Semantic Indexing, which means the closest word in terms of meaning. For example, if your content keyword is a car, the LSI keywords are engine, car, wheel, and so on. In other words, when we use synonyms and words close to it instead of the keyword, LSI keywords are part of SEO content and internal SEO techniques. And when we want to do keyword research for our content, we must also consider the LSI words, which I will explain in this video from Nitro SEO. Before I go into details, I recommend that if it's your first time getting to know Nitro SEO YouTube channel, subscribe our channel and turn on the notifications. What are synonyms? It is synonymous with a word or phrase that has the same meaning or at least is close to the meaning of that word, like the rich and wealthy. Google has always had a problem with synonyms. Different people search for the same needs in different words. Research has shown that on average, both people use the same keyword less than 20% of the time to express their desires. Now, what does this have to do with the search engine? Suppose we have two separate pages from two different sites, both of which write about car features. The first site used only the car keyword and the second site used synonyms such as car, engine, tire, and etc. If the search engine only paid attention to the main keyword, it should only show the first site in the results. But this is not true because both sites have the same and related content. The importance of LSI keywords in internal SEO Computers are very stupid. They have no understanding of human relations and the intrinsic meaning of words unless they are giving this information. And the problem is that there is no way to give this information to a computer. LSI keywords use this problem with complex mathematical formulas to extract word and phrase relationships. When we search for spring, summer, autumn, and winter together, the search engine realizes that these words are semantically related. Search engines with the help of LSI keywords can show more relevant results beyond accurate queries. So LSI keywords have a great impact on improving the internal SEO of your site. Does Google use LSI keywords for ranking? For the problems that LSI keywords solve, the answer to this question is yes, but Google executives have always said that Google does not use LSI keyword technology. But why? 1. LSI technology is very old. LSI keywords were invented in 1980, before the advent of the web, so it's natural for Google to use better and newer methods for more relevant documents. Two. LSI keywords were created to index Google documents. The World Wide Web is not only large, but also dynamic. That means billions of pages are being indexed in Google Docs, and this is a problem in itself. The LSI parent tells us that every time there is a significant update to Google stored documents, it needs to be analyzed, and this requires a lot of processing power. Three. The LSI patent was granted to the Bell Research Organizations in 1989. The US patent is set to expire after 20 years, and as a result, patent for LSI keywords expired in 2008. But Google mastered related languages and related words and phrases long before that date. It can be said that Google no longer uses this technology. For all the reasons we give, you still need to include the keywords, phrases, and entities associated with the original keyword in the content, as these words help Google better understand our content, resulting in better rankings. How to find LSI keywords Normally, when you want to write about a topic, you enter words that have the same meaning and relevance in the text. And for example, if the content of this page is about Dubai tour, words such as foreign travel tour, immigration, visa, and etc. can be your LSIs. 
Here are some simple yet practical ways to find LSI keywords. Use Google suggestions. Related phrases that appear at the bottom of every Google page are the best source for LSI keywords because they are searched by users. Autocomplete results. You must have seen that when you search for a word or phrase on Google, the results will automatically complete your sentence before it is finished. These results may not always give you the best LSI, but they can be good clues about the content you intend to write about. Use LSI Keyword Tools In the following, we will introduce you to three important tools in finding LSI keywords. Keys for Up Keys for Up is a very simple LSI keyword generator that provides you with about 10 LSI words per user search. If you want to have full access to your keyword list, you must register with your email address. However, after a few more queries, the web page wants you to share this tool on your social media to get more complete list of keywords, which is very inconvenient. In addition, this tool allows you to display LSI keywords containing one, two, or more words. This makes it easy if you're looking for long tail keywords. A special feature of this tool is the 4-up indicator, which indicates how often you need to include that LSI keyword in your content. Twin Word Ideas LSI Graph Twin Word Ideas LSI Graph is another interesting tool. Instead of a list, it visualizes the semantic relationships between the keywords. Without any restriction on LSI-generated keywords, you will receive an unlimited number of users. Compared to other free LSI tools, Twin Word Ideas LSI Graph generates unique LSI keywords that can increase the relevance of your content to your topic. In addition to the LSI chart, you can also check trend-related keywords, including information such as search volume, organic competition, monetary competition, and relevance. All this information can be graphically visualized or downloaded as an Excel, CSV, or Open Document file. In addition, Twin Word Ideas can also generate keyword suggestions for your topic, allowing you to filter filters using user goals such as knowing, doing, and buying. In general, Twin Word Ideas and its LSI charts can not only find the right LSI keywords for your content, but can also help you create your future content using additional tools. LSI Graph this LSI graph is a simple yet common tool for LSI keywords. Without registration, you only can do a few searches a day, each containing about 50 LSI keywords. Even after registration, the daily search limit will increase to only about 20 search queries. In addition, this tool generates many long tail keywords, meaning that a keyword usually contains at least three words as well as questions and sentences that can be used to inspire the title. This tool can be useful in the early stages of producing your content. However, given the limited number of search queries, you need to be sure which keywords you want to analyze. Unfortunately, LSI Graph does not give the option to create a complete list or select a list. However, the LSI keyword list can be easily copied and pasted into other documents. Because this tool is called LSI Graph, you might expect to see some visual representations of the generated list, but it is not. This tool has no special features and does not provide any additional information, but it's very easy to use and does not require special skills or knowledge about SEO. Conclusion People with different languages and dialects search for their needs and wants in the search engine, so it is natural that the words they use are different. Therefore, using LSI keywords in the content is a great solution.